there! It's Cheryl again from Quali Student. I'm here today to talk to you about our project wiki tool, Confluence. Accessing Confluence is a breeze. You just go to kiss.kowali.org and then log in if you're not already logged in. I'm logged in already. And we go to services and then the wiki. You should pull up your dashboard right here. You can see all the activity across the project or just on favorite spaces. If you haven't already, I'd make sure your profile is up to date. Because we're a distributed project, it's helpful to have a photo and some info about you in Confluence so we can all stay connected. So just click on the top right drop down and go to Profile. You can see I wrote a little bit about myself as well as added a photo. To change the picture, click on Picture in the left sidebar. There you can choose to upload a picture. Little profile picture here. And then upload. Now it gives me the option to choose where in the picture I want. And then save. Now I can set it as my profile picture. See? There we go. So now that that's out of the way, let's talk about some of the basics of Confluence. First off, the big red create button. Sometimes the most obvious things are hidden to us, so I wanted to point this out. When you want to create a new page, you go to Create and select your space. We'll talk about spaces in a second. Um, you can start from any of these templates or um, you know, just start from scratch with a blank page. Some of the doc types require a template. For example, you, you get down here, you need epics, how-to guides, tech guides. These were specifically created by our um, information architect, Mark Kurtz. So if you have questions about those, those are there. Um, so just make sure you, you know what template you're supposed to be using. Um, I frequently start with a blank page. You click, click Create, and it'll take you to the Create screen. Another hidden in plain sight item are the search boxes. Um, this is where you can go to find just about anything you need, um, pages, files, people. <laughs> so you type my name in, you get um, some of the names of pages I've made, as well as some pictures that have my name on them, and then, you know, my, m me and myself. Um, so that's good to know. There's also typically on the left hand side, there will be a search box here. And these are usually search boxes within the space. To learn more about spaces, check out our next video.